Channel 4 presents a thought-provoking ad break. At Channel 4, we champion unheard voices and stand up for inclusion. That's why we've joined with some of our advertising partners to highlight the growing issue of abuse towards customer-facing staff in the UK, of which there are more than 150,000 incidents each year. The following ad break features real employees who love their jobs and the abuse and threatening behaviour that they and others like them have experienced. The language used may shock you. What I love most about working with the general public is the stories. People are absolutely awesome, some are hilarious, some are sweet and kind. Just put someone else on your incompetent love. Good people. Incompetent, you know what that means. And that's what I really love about it. You never quite put know what on. that call is going to be until you take it. Is that what you think is it? Yeah. It's nice when you, know you can just make like that connection with someone. Oh, you're a you are. Even if it's just briefly. What's your name? There's something kind of lovely about hearing hear their experiences. Shut up, you And it's that moment when they say thank you. I slept last What's night. What's your name, you stupid bitch? I had all the stress and the worry took away from me and I slept. I hope your kids die of cancer, you miserable fool. That's worth all the thank yous in the world. I'm your kids, you your dirty mom. Knowing that you're What's truly your helping somebody. Customer-facing staff working in the UK experience more than 400 abuse incidents every single day. I know my dad's proud of me for working at the co-op because he works for the co-op. Anytime I need advice, it's always dad that I call first. I've got a lot of uh, regular customers come in every morning, uh, elderly customers that just want to have a conversation with me. Just because they don't have anybody else, so some of them are quite lonely. Our job entails working within the community. We are part of the community. It makes you feel involved with the community. Community. 43% of shop workers said they had been threatened with physical violence. One in five mentioned the use of a knife. I really love working with the general public because I like to help people and it's such a varied role. I can start the shift and I haven't a clue what's going to happen. Last Christmas an elderly lady came through to us at the station. She got on the wrong train. She was so upset and she was meeting her son. I went up to her and said, don't worry, we'll get you home. We had a good chat, some hot drinks and some mince pies. It was lovely to find out what she'd been doing all her life. And at the end, she was so happy and thankful. I get a real sense of pride from that. 70% of frontline rail staff have experienced workplace violence in the last 12 months. Fortunately, this type of abuse and violence comes from a small minority of people, but it's never okay. So let's work together to build a more tolerant and mutually respectful society for everyone. If you were shocked by the incidents featured in this ad break or have experienced them yourself, Go to channel4.com forward slash together against hate for information and support.